A federal judge today ruled that employees of Rager Dykes Auto Group will be paid for the last two weeks. Good evening and thanks so much for choosing KLBK News. I'm Terry Furman. John has the evening off. Our Mahdi Salazar was at that emergency hearing today. Mahdi, this is good news for the company's employees. Today's ruling was some good news for employees who were supposed to be paid two days ago, but the judge allowed the company to pay them today. If the judge had not allowed that today, the dealerships may have been forced to close their doors. Ford Motor Credit Company filed for objection in the bankruptcy case this morning, but the judge decided the paychecks would be cut before the end of today. The money being used to pay employees is not owed to Ford, and it's also not within Ford's right to demand. Ford did say during the hearing they just want its collateral to get maximum protection. And this all comes three days after Ford Motor Credit filed a lawsuit against Rager Dykes. They claim the company was late in reporting sales of vehicles and they owed them more than $40 million. Bart Rager and Rick Dykes were both in court with their attorneys today. Another bankruptcy court hearing is set for August 16th. All right. Now, did Rager and his or his attorney have anything to say today after court? Uh, we, ca we caught them on the way out, and I tried to ask David Langston, uh, Bart Rager's attorney, if they had anything to say. He had no comment. I asked Bart Rager if he had anything to say to his customers, and he just said thank you. So that's all we've heard from them. All right. Now, what else in court today stuck out to you? Well, one interesting thing is that all the demo vehicles will be have uh, will be returned in the next 24 hours, and those cars are owned by employees and tech coaches so the, wow. like those cars are going to be have to be returned in the next 24 hours all right so definitely something good to know Mommy, yep. thank you